गुड मॉर्निंग माई डियर चिल्ड्रन एंड वेलकम टू द ऑनलाइन क्लास ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स डे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट अ न्यू टॉपिक एंड आर टॉपिक इज एडिशन नाउ वट डज एडिशन मीन्स एडिशन मीन्स ज्वाइनिंग एडिशन मीन्स कम्बाइनिंग एडिशन मीन्स टू पुट थिंग्स टूगेदर एडिशन मीन्स फाइंडिंग द टोटल और सम ऑफ गिवन ऑब्जेक्ट्स Let us take an example. Three birds and two birds is equal to five birds. Two cows and two cows is equal to four cows. Four fish and two fish is equal to six fish. Let us understand the symbol equal to. When we have same number of things on both the sides, it is said to be equal. For example, in this picture, we have three boats on the left hand sides and three planes on the right hand side. Three is equal to three, so it will be written as three is equal to three. Another example is we have eight rockets on the left hand side and eight ice creams on the right hand side. Eight is equal to eight, and we will write it as eight is equal to eight. Let's take another example. In this picture, you can see two frogs and four frogs. Two and four make six, so we will write it as two plus four. is equal to 6 another example is in this picture we can see three balls and two balls 3 and 2 make 5 so we will write it as 3 plus 2 is equal to 5 now let us understand the addition property of 0 and 1 addition property of 0 and 1 when we add 0 to a number the number remains the same in this picture you can see that we have three balls and then we add zero ball to it the we will get number 3 so when we add zero to a number the number remains the same here we can see that when we add zero to a number the number remains the same in this picture we have eight crayons 8 plus 0 is equal to 8 thus it is clear that when we add zero to a number the number remains the same Another property of addition is when we add one to a number, we get the next number. So in number five, when we'll add one, we'll get number six. Another example is if we add one to number nine, we'll get the next number ten. So it is clear that when we add one to a number, we get the next number. So children in this topic we have learned that when we add 0 to a number the number remains the same and when we add 1 to a number we get the next number we have learned how to add horizontally that is in a sleeping line order so children that is all for today stay home and stay safe thank you so much